Hello to all the viewers. Well, I am delighted to have with me Dr. Sagar Choudhury, who has secured rank two in the NEET SS DM Neurology entrance exam. Sagar, first of all, hearty congratulations for this big rank for your hard work and commitment. Thank you, thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Okay. So, uh, Sagar, uh, to begin this short interview, just tell us a bit about yourself, your college of MBBS and post-graduation. Uh, I am coming from Gujarat. I have done my MBBS from NHL Medical College, Ahmedabad. And uh, I have done my MD Medicine from BJMC Ahmedabad. I currently working as a senior resident in BJMC Ahmedabad Civil Hospital. Okay, very good. So just tell us um, at what point of your career did you think, okay, I should go for neurology as a super speciality? Actually, sir, I am confused, uh, confused in two subjects, nephrology and neurology. Okay. Uh, after second time NB change pattern, uh, then I started preparing for neurology. Okay. All right. First, first, uh, first all pattern I done a one month study for nephrology. Okay. Yes. All right. All right. So, you know, uh, it's an awesome rank that you have got the second rank and that too in a such a competitive exam. And not just that, see, um, for your batch, there was a lot of exam pattern changes, everything happening. So yes, good thing about you is that you maintained your composure and prepared and you've got such a good rank. So, uh, so you were actually, uh, you know, uh, sincerely following the doc tutorials, exam series, question bank. So just tell us, how did you find the, uh, say the question bank of doc tutorials? Was it useful for your preparation? Absolutely, sir. Uh, uh, doc tutorial question bank, uh, mostly based on Bradley. And uh, I have study in MIMD medicine, mostly Harrison based. Okay. That uh, uh, question bank added my knowledge, which was very useful. Yeah. So what we did is that even in the exams that we conducted in the question bank, we made it mostly a Bradley based one. Whereas um, in the elite exam series, we used to put questions from Harrison, clinical scenario based questions, long stem clinical based questions, so that you are all ready with everything. Because yes, you would agree with me, no, whenever you prepare for an entrance pattern, nobody yes. can exactly guess the pattern. Because Sagar, you know, might have observed this time in the exam, unlike a conventional neat SS exam, the number of image-based questions and long stem questions were more. And uh, Sagar has also given the INI exam also. So he would know that more than INI SS, the, num the clinical questions were more in neat SS. Correct, Sagar? Yes. Or, uh, and in neat SS, question was unpredictable. In INISS, we can predict clinical base, some topic. In uh, NEET SS, there is no such topic. Okay. Anything can. Yeah, correct. And let me ask you just one question. You know, you gave that exam in the exam hall. Just tell us honestly, you know, you gave the exam. After coming out of the exam hall, did you think that you're going to get in top, uh, say, five ranks? No, sir. i confident about good rank. Okay. Not uh, confident for top five. Yeah, so, uh, you know, initially the uh, mark list was released and by that time itself, you know, we had also published a tentative rank list and that time itself, you know, you would know that, you know, you have got uh, such a good rank. Good rank, and, yes. Uh, now the official rank list is also, also out, so you are rank two, so that's great. Yes. Now, uh, Sagar, you know, we had conducted multiple mock exams in doc tutorials, like, uh, you know, we had conducted separate topic wise exams even for national mock exams like INISS yes. NEET SS mock exam so just tell us one thing what was your rank in the NEET SS mock exam of Dr. tutorials sir in my NEET SS doctor tutorial mock exam I got second rank second rank so same, as, same as a NEET uh, same, uh, yeah. so exactly yeah. the same rank of NEET SS mock exam you got in you know, this one also, that is wonderful. Even for INI exam also, you know, the, uh, I still remember, you know, our student Pushkar was having a good rank. You know, he was 
maintaining the same top rank for the uh, you know the uh, a final result as well that's great yes, yes, so um, so after you saw that result you know your mock exam uh, rank 2 because there is good number of students already gave the exam those who were seriously preparing they they would have actually given the exam so did that boost your confidence and you got the feeling okay i think i am in the right track uh, yes sir in uh, inss examination i got quali qualified rank okay. but not selected uh, then uh, after one week uh, dr 12 uh, uh, conducted a neat ss mock test examination I got second rank uh, that boost my confidence. Okay. Now, uh, what advice you know you have to give to your juniors? So, uh, you know, many of the, them who will be watching this interview, some of them will be medicine first year residents, second year residents. Definitely, yes. my advice to everyone would be you should focus on residency very much. Yes, for yes, entrance sir. purposes, you have got to focus on these MCQs and all, but residency is very important. And your focus yes, maximum on residency. What is your take on that, uh, Sagar? Absolutely, sir. Because uh, mostly examination questions are clinical based, image based. Uh, there is nothing uh, like a one liner examination. Yeah, correct. So pattern was changed. This is very important because um, many students feel you know they just want to keep reading and then you know they can appear for the entrance exam. But this time, what I realized is that many students who might not have read very thoroughly, but they have attended their residency sincerely and their clinical knowledge is also good. Plus they have given these exams also because in doc tutorials also we conducted many exams with these long stem clinical questions. So some sort of exam practice and many of them got good rank even without too much voracious reading. So a very important message from Sagar to the juniors is that please be attentive you know, mindfully in the wards, learn from the wards as well. And uh, Sagar, you know, is a perfect example for that. Uh, because when there came an exam with clinical scenarios, logic, decision making, Sagar, I think, you know, his residency training also helped him. So I'm sure that Sagar, you must be thankful to the teachers of your college as well. Yes, sir. My, i thankful to my PG teacher okay. and uh, classes like you, sir. So great. Um, so uh, Sagar, uh, thank you so much for joining. And um, I'm sure that the viewers who would have watched this would have understood, okay, uh, how to prepare for the uh, entrance exam. Because see, uh, one thing everyone should understand is in one exam, if you did not do well, you need not get too much disheartened. Correct, Sagar? Yes, yes. yes. Because see, Sagar sure. got a decent rank in INISS. He qualified but he could not make it, uh, you know, to the top. Some yes, yes. candidates will feel very much depressed. I have not done well. But Sagar, you see, he maintained his composure and now he's ranked two, which means, you know, he can choose any neurology college in India. Mm -hmm. All right. So uh, everybody at home are also happy with your achievement, Sagar? Yes, yes, sir. Okay. okay. All right, Sagar. Thank you so much for joining. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you, sir.